can dance if we want to We can leave your friends behind Cause your friends don't dance And if they don't dance Well, they no friends of mine You're listening to Home Wizards. I'm Cindy Dole. Hey, I'm Eric Stromer. And everybody has it. We have a junk drawer. Oh, you got, you've boy. Got, don't you have a junk drawer? I got about 10 of them. Uh, yeah, so that's yeah. the thing. We have multiple junk drawers. And not that they're bad. No. But they can it's be... The f- I think it's the first indicator that things have gone really out of control. <laughs> yeah, be- you know? we have multiple ones because now yeah. you can't remember, well, wait, which junk drawer is my junk in? <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> you and know? then, and, you know, my daughter's really into art and she... She creates things all day long, every day, to the point where I just want to say, if you make another art piece, I'm going to set myself on fire. You've got to stop. I've got to clean these drawers out, right? Mm -hmm. And she'll keep pulling stuff out, putting it back in, cramming it in, shoving it in, and then ripping the door face off, Uh and then throwing the stuff on the floor. You know, like that's where she is. So Mm -hmm. it's an uphill battle, and I don't have a system in place to create order because it changes every seven seconds. Because right? you have little elves L- Little elves changing and raccoon order. paws going in my drawers. Well, this right? is going to be perfect for you because yeah. here's the thing. If you turn a junk drawer into sections, and you could even get really obsessive. You mean like dividers. Dividers, and it could almost be labeled. Then everyone knows it always goes in that That's section. That's a great idea. Because otherwise it's a cavernous cave. That's what it is. It's just you open it up and you ram it in there and you shut it. I mean, you, listen, you know? I, I just yesterday there was a hairbrush fishing line. Huh? And and then nails and clay that just was wet, wet clay in the, like, what are you guys doing? What it's is this? It's almost like a skit. Like, hey, <laughs> yeah. what, what story can you tell with what can, these four How items? can we drive Dad crazy? <laughs> let's put crazy things in this drawer. That's kind of the feel of okay. it. Okay. So, yeah. Well, so let's talk about one junk drawer. Yeah. Unless, because otherwise you get overwhelmed. We well, don't want to anatom- You're talking about the anatomy of a junk drawer. Yeah. 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 What does that look like? So, so first of all, you have everything rammed in there, right. flowing, free flowing, sure. and that's where because it doesn't have a purpose. You can't find what you wanted, and then it, it gives you that reason that it's okay to put anything in there because anything's in there already. That's, you, <laughs> you know, know what? That, like, you know, it, there's no definition. It's you're, it's simple and absolutely true because if it doesn't, if it's not defined as to what goes in here, anything can go. Anything in Anything can go in. It's there. Random. That's exactly <laughs> it's a right. Random drawer. Yeah. So how about this for this weekend? We'd like you to take one junk drawer. Maybe you're so good you don't have any, but I'm thinking you may have. Maybe you have half of a junk drawer. But you're going to take one drawer, and I want you to take everything out of the drawer, everything out of it. And then, you know, that old thing where you put them into piles of all the different things. So put everything out on a table, and what do you have in you? You have the artwork. Yeah. You have the fishing line. Right. You might have some kitchen spoons. You might have some takeout menus. Mm-hmm. Pens, got a lot of those. You've got keys, maybe some keys that had never what, been what, used. Where are these what keys key? coming from? It's like, what, do I, what do I have, a castle with like skeleton keys yeah, on a... you might have some masking tape, right. you might have, you know, you, you get the idea. All these things that are randomly in there, you might have a flashlight, take them all out and put them into piles of randomness. Right. You mean then, like group things the yeah. same? Yeah. Okay. I mean, if you even have groups, you might have, yeah. like, nothing even goes together. Sure. What I'd like you to do then is now fill... Or actually, before you fill it, I want you to measure the drawer. Okay. Measure the drawer. The interior of the drawer. The interior yeah. of the drawer. One and, way by one way. Yeah, maybe. Would you suggest maybe even taking the interior of your drawer to a store? I would. Yeah. I, I absolutely would bring the physical drawer because then you know you're not going to make a mistake in terms of what you're buying as an insert. Yeah. Is, if, is that, that, that's your point, I, right? I, I yeah. think it's a good idea yeah, because, because now, you know, you're going to be able to fit it so that every little item would be perfectly in there. I mean, You're going to maximize space. Yeah, I mean, let's say that you can find some of these containers. In fact, we've been talked about how you can make your own, but some yeah. of these little inserts are like 10 or 15 different sizes, like just for scissors or for batteries or for Post-it notes or for your reading glasses. Or, and then so like you're, you're, where are you talking about going, like a, like a, the container store kind of a place? Or, or even cheaper places. Place. Yeah. I mean, even like, you know, Bed Bath & Beyond. 99 cents store 99, probably has, Everyone, yeah. even in the office supply places, Got it. everyone is into this. And, okay. But the key now is I'd like you to put all all those things that are on the table that you've taken out of the drawer and put it in a baggie, in just, a Ziploc baggie. Just one bag. It, well, maybe you have multiple. Well, I know I do. Okay, put them in whatever you need to fit. Okay. And then mark on the side of it the date. Yeah. And put it maybe somewhere, I don't know, in a, in a high cabinet in another room. Okay. Okay? And then mark on your calendar. Maybe you use a Google calendar in your iPhone or you have a physical calendar and basically check the bag in two months. I guarantee you. 
you will never think of anything that was in that drawer. Yeah, and guess where it goes now? Right in the old garbage can. There it went. <laughs> That's good. Except, except for Willow's artwork. She, well, she no, probably... you know what? Listen, I'm starting to throw it out a little bit. Mm, I love her to death, but maybe... yeah, it's enough already. Well, how or many take a picture hey, of hey, it. hey, how many times do I have to see a camel? <laughs> oh, she's drawing camels? <laughs> well, she's oh. that, among other things. Oh. Great stuff. All way. right. Yeah. Well, so here's some other things you can do. Now that, you've, now that you've taken things out of the drawer, we're coming up with ways to come up with division inside you know, your, your drawer. Yeah. You could also cut a piece of newspaper to the size of your drawer and take that along. And, oh, and lay that out and put the stuff on and top. And take that with you to the store and it helps you kind of puzzle together a fit, right? Yeah. Um, I like taking the drawer because what about the height of the drawer and all that yeah, stuff? Yeah, yeah. You know? And I also like maybe if you do think that you like, let's say you want to have a measuring tape. Do you like to have a measuring tape in your kitchen drawer? I carry one everywhere. Okay. Well, so yeah. so or maybe you want to have a calculator or maybe you want to have something that's tied to your, you know, your iPhone charger or something, little things that you would for sure want to have. Certainly, measure. Pen, certainly pencils, pens, and then yeah. like, you know, paper clip uh -huh. business and all. Yeah. Uh -huh. Matches and maybe. Good. Yeah. So figure out like what kind of space uh, that you would need for those. Yeah. So you're going to allocate and assign areas for your cubbies, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I got you. And then, you know, if you want to have your own inserts and you want to be going on, you know, on the cheap, you know, the great, those great little gift boxes, mm -hmm. the blue boxes. That Stop are it. You mean Tiffany? The <laughs> Tiffany. Hey, listen to me. I got, I got, <laughs> I have to digress here. I was in New York a couple of weeks ago and I walked into a Tiffany's. Nice. Put on a wedding ring that I, cause I, I don't have a wedding ring. I lost yeah, it. Yeah. I've, I've had five of them and they, uh -huh. I either lose them or I hate wearing them cause I don't like the way they feel, but I tried one on there. And you bought one? No, I didn't buy it. I, I think I'm gonna though. Cause it, it's phenomenal. This really? Thing. It's kind of, it's, they call it the, the comfort band. It's oh. sort of roundy white gold or platinum. Uh oh. I put it on. I was with my best friend from college. Uh, we looked at each other in the eye, and uh, there was a moment there where we just thought maybe we should get married. <laughs> but, but no, wait, no, I'm already married to my wife. Sorry. But the romance it brings up, oh, I was overwhelmed. But oh, seriously, really beautiful. Great. But I, it's too expensive. I can't well, do it. So that's I'd rather issue. buy dividers for the All right. door. But you, you <clears> could, you go, could go to Tiffany and say, could I buy, or maybe you could give me one of your boxes. There's a dream. Yeah. But get the idea is get jewelry boxes, either the long, you know, bracelet boxes yeah. or the shorter little square boxes and you can paper clip them together or maybe some other technique uh, that you would yeah. suggest. Just glue them maybe. Glue them together yeah. and then now you can just kind of come up with your own little puzzle and configuration in your drawer. I, I don't mean, know. It seems like a lot of work. You could probably buy them for seven bucks, be done with it. I know. It. I know. I'm just but, saying. But you know, I know you just want more an excuse to get more of those boxes. I do. I <laughs> well, that's also kind of like then you have a wish list. You go, I can't get the ring now. Hey, wait. But good, it's coming. But good news. There's only like nine weekends until Christmas, so Thank maybe you. your Thank friend you. Eric Stone will find you a little something, a little brooch or something <laughs> oh, from the, the old box. Tiffany's. Just this, the box. Oh no, I'm I want the something. box. All right. How about this? Also, by the way, if you have one of those um, drawers in your bedroom area, you know where you have your, you know your undies and such. Yeah. You can you can create little quadrants by style and by color, and that way that also helps you kind of. To stay more organized in well, that, that. Now that it's starting room. to look like Nordstrom's. Now you got me. You yeah. had you had me at underwear rolling up. Right. <laughs> yeah, that's good stuff. But now it's it's neat and it's you know it's a little more fun now to deal with sure. your with your drawer. I'm just saying that that might be another junk drawer because you know how many times have you... I have I have them all. I yeah. got junk everywhere. Yeah. Um, another thing that you might want to consider. Yeah. You know, don't forget the nightstand. You can apply the same compartment. Oh. Principles there. You, you know, you've been going through my drawers, haven't no, you? No, I, I have. I'm guilty. I have this too. I mean, I've got like um, a bunch of like lip balm in there. I've got some batteries. I've got a flashlight. Yep. You know, hair clippies, and it's just rammed in there. You know, maybe an old remote control that doesn't even go to the TV yep. that we use. And so again, take everything out, put it in a baggie, mark the date, go to the calendar, remind yourself in two I months. Love that. Meantime, take compartments. You know, and now you're going to figure out. Well, what is it that you really want? What are the essentials by your bed? You want to have your glasses maybe. Yeah, gotta have them. You know, whatever you might if want. If you're a multiple glasses person. You might want the remote in yeah. there, you know, whatever, those kind of things. Yeah. Here's another idea. If you have another junk drawer where maybe it's in an office and you've got pens and pencils and things and they're rolling around, another good idea is to get some of this kind of a non-skid rug pad and, and you kind of put that in the, on the lower level of oh, the drawer. Oh, like a so. low pile carpet piece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like even one of those floor tiles would work. Yes. Cut it into pieces. 
Those are pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the idea is now, because you're not only going to be able to find things, but it won't drive you nuts, because after you've created your order, you don't want it to roll back oh, Yeah, I, I hate that. You're right. Or what about making your drawer not only so compartmentalized that you can find things, but it's pretty, like wallpaper inside the drawer, oh. and now it's going to incentivize you to keep it looking neat, because now it's just pretty on the inside. Sure, yeah, I understand that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you could get a little sample, you know, a yard of... Sometimes they'll give those away just as a, you know, I want to take this home and hold it up on my yeah. wall. Really, I'm cutting it into pieces. Yeah. Put it so, in my drawer. And don't forget utensil trays. You can get these utensil trays yeah, from the kitchen store. Yeah, that's huge. I can't tell you. And use that in your bathroom. Oh, my for your, goodness. You know, well, I find your utensil drawers or utensils in my bedside oh, table because of oh, my daughter. All right. Well, so now you got to yeah. label all these things and then Willow will be trained. There and, you go. You know, all right. Eric Stromer, Good Sydney Bill. You're listening to Home Wizards and remember to check us at yourhomewizards.com. In your heart, 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 I'll dream.